This is Fat Bee Man, and I'm down in the bee yard, and I've got something I want to show you. Now, most people wouldn't want to put this up. We went through some hives today with some students, and we found a queen that had severe mite problems. None of these hives at the bee yard has been treated in any way this year. So this is the first, and this is another thing, which we call out our queens and we check them for quality. This is a live queen. I'll dump her out here. There she is. Now you can look. I'm going to see if I can't get telephoto in here. What I want you to see is this queen she doesn't have any Back up here, Queen. She don't have no wings. This is what a queen looks like when the larva is made from a hive that's got mite problems. You notice the queen, she's short, she's alive. We put this queen in a bottle. It's an old drinking bottle. We put it in here, and I told the students, we're gonna put this up and show people. And my wife says, Oh no, people think you got bad problems, but I'm doing this to show that you get mites and what they'll do. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put her in a bottle. I'm going to make queen lure out of her. Now you can see she's still alive. Get back up on the wide angle. Now I got my queen lure bottle here. Here's my queen. She's alive. I'm going to put her in the alcohol. There she goes. Now what we're doing is basically making queen lure. What we're doing is quality control. I like to check every hive, every queen, and make sure we have good quality queens. And this is the only way you can get it. You have to call out the ones that's bad. And if you have a bad one, Take your lemons, squeeze them, make lemonade. What I'm going to do is just let this in the bottle here and it'll be a queen lure. But <clears throat> you need to check your hive, look for the damage on the wings, or you start to see K wing, then start to treat. We do treatment here when the students come and I teach them different ways to treat. But I'm saying again, none of the hives have been treated at all this year with anything. We didn't have much trouble this year with the small high beetle and we will probably start to treat for that probably next week. We're seeing one or two high beetles just here and there and I have a lot of my hives under the trees. I hope you find that this video is a little bit informative and don't look at it the wrong way and just keep watching the fat bee man and I'll try to bring you little tidbits here and there. After all, I'm trying to teach this online free of charge. If you enjoy the videos, send a donation, DixieBeesupply.com. Thanks for watching.